Yeah, yeah. Y'all see that? It's cold as fuck. I'm doing this for us. I'll say. I need to stop trying to make it a one thing. It's just I'm doing this for us, man. It's cold. <gasps> What's that? Look at that in the sky, you guys. Can you see it? You see that? You see that thing right there? It looks like a fucking rocket. I'm gonna record it and probably. Well, I don't want to edit. I don't feel like editing. Damn, I, I wish it was better quality. But something's falling. I don't know what that is. It's cool as fuck. I thought it was a. Um, I thought that it was a. Uh, a rocket. Wait, what is that though? What is that, yo? Something falling to the ground. I don't know what it is. But something falling. Damn. Before 111, though? Before January 11, 2023? That shit is, like, it's just falling. What is that? Something falling out the sky. It's falling slow motion, though. And I'm recording it on video. <laughs> That shit funny as fuck. It's not what it is because it's like, damn, they caught me off guard. But what is that? It's not a shoe. Start because that shit falling straight down. What is it? I like I can see. I really can't. Yo, what is that? No, made no sense. I was just trying to watch the sunset. Why look like it's just sitting in the sky now? It don't even look like it's falling anymore. It's just... I'm confused. Something else is in the sky, though. Over well, that's a that's a little jet rocket. Whatever they want to act like it is, they tell us it is. Let me stop. It's <laughs> it's a jet. <laughs> Whatever. Um, damn, I'm trying to record it. Like, I'm sorry. That shit is so fucking cool. I'm acting like y'all can see this shit. I'm probably gonna post. Well, it don't matter if I post on TikTok because can can nobody see it. But shit. I'm done. And now I'm finna just watch it. Dang, I don't wanna waste this whole video of me staring like. I, uh, I wish y'all could see this because this shit just falling. Nobody's here. What the fuck? What the fuck, motherfucker? I wanna show y'all again, like, at this point. I'm trying to see if it'll show up on the screen. If it'll show up on the screen, it's not showing up. But this shit is flying. This shit is flying. Um, well, not flying, but it, it looked like it's landing that way. Like, at first it was going straight down. Now it's, like, going towards that way. I ain't got no... My phone's off. And I can't even... I can't even look this up to see if somebody's talking about it. This is supposed to be for the boys, too. <laughs> you see how something... Some shit fucking happens? Because of y'all. Every time. Uh, I didn't even know that shit was going to happen. Intuition, babes. So I want y'all to hear this song. It's a poem by S Sims. Um, See the creator. Hi. I'm, I'm Sydney. No, it's not this one. It's this one. To the boy who doesn't believe in love. I'm writing this because in spite of the new media age, letters do still exist and so do good intentions. I don't know who handled your vulnerability so recklessly that now you're too afraid to exist separate from the person that you show the world. I bet you wish you never made your superhero someone who only saw you as a sidekick. I know you wish you never gave your last to someone who would have never put you first, but is a weird way of finding us. It seems as though even in the darkest places it manages to sense our unease and relieve us with an idea of comfort and even then, that doesn't negate from the fact that love is one of the most complex entities on earth. It's the thing that humans are most afraid to meet and for good reason. It's as if a fantasy is more appealing than the real thing so chain ourselves to false ideas and societal norms when we don't even have to. Maybe that was your mistake. You tried to search for love when it was as simple as your daydreams. It's not fair that life made you a man before you matured, but they never told you you can't use your fists here. 
even weapons of mass destruction malfunction when match with love so stop trying to fight me off and i really only want to be everything that you ever asked for i want to talk to the boy who repressed his feelings for fear of rejection to the boy who hasn't been held since birth and is now a boy in a grown man's body to the boy who's forever in search of a home who found residence in the remnants of someone else's mess stop trying to be the handyman for everyone else but yourself i know things get tough but you don't always have to be and you move through life with overcast shadows of lonely moving over you like clouds whether you want me to or not i'm going to speak sunshine into your darkest days to the sidekick unveil yourself and reveal to me your identity you'll be happy to know that you you are my superhero I just wanted to uplift y'all right quick. <laughs> I'm sorry if I'm so distracted. But for real, my original plan when I came out here was to play that. Because I, I know I'd be hard on the men. Because my boyfriend be reminding me. He's like, damn, like, give us a break. And it's like, okay, I guess. But I'm so distracted because that shit came out of nowhere. And it was big as fuck. So I know it was probably like a rocket, comet, plant. Something was falling out the sky. And it was it was heading straight down so we got to see where that's where it's coming from you know and i still made a wish i was like yeah let me go ahead and make this money like let me go ahead and make this money and all my shit blow up I'm, all my my youtube my fee page my shout out to my fee page all hell our goddess you know what it is you can do what it is you don't know what it is pay me tribute um yeah that in the best way in the most like like extreme expeditiously like extravagant magnificent excellent tay way you know like for real like i want this shit to work out for me in the best way possible so that i don't have to work because i'm over a job and i'm 22 like i don't know how the fuck people are doing it for 30 years like no i'm not doing it i get paid to exist Everything that I do, everything I touch makes money. Every All the money just comes to me because it loves me. It loves being in my pocket. It loves being in my account. It loves being in my assets. It loves being on me. Like, come on now. Come on now. Like, money knows that I know what to do with it. So, it, that's why. That's why it keeps coming to me. Period. Yeah, so, I was basically saying all that, like, intellectually to the, the comment, whatever it was falling. I feel like it low-key it was. Or probably something was crashing because I don't understand how like direct it was. Like this shit, like it was coming across, and then nobody else is here. Like literally, it's a ghost town right now because nobody's up. And I'm glad I get to experience that. I love experiencing things on my own where no one would probably believe me, but I wouldn't really give a fuck because I love the fact that I saw that. Like man, that like y'all saw it a little bit, but it was just like it's always like those low quality videos that I talk shit about. And here I am with a low quality, can't even prove this shit. But it's not like I put in the sky, so I don't give a fuck. That shit was cool, though. I probably look cock out and all because I'm looking up. <laughs> Back to you, America. Thank you, our goddess. Um, yeah, we shall be done with the video because the parking dude came back well no they look like another white car hold on shit what he doing oh yeah he is never mind well he, he looked like a little bit but i can't tell okay he got a light on i was trying to cut out the video because why he get so close to my car trying to be nosy like bye well i'm talking about i need to get off shit where he go though oh he's still rolling around I think he's trying to look at my car. Maybe he didn't see me because I forgot I got a tent. I got a little bit of tent, but shit, it's foggy too, so it looked like somebody was probably fucking in here. I mean, uh, breathing in here. I can't tell. He probably saw my headphones though, because he was looking dead. He wasn't looking dead at me, but he was looking like, like this nigga, he could have hit the back of my car, like how close he was trying to ride by and shit. Trying to be on cruise control and shit, because what the fuck? He don't even look like a, the real deal. But he probably is, because he's just sitting there. 
Fuck it. I mean, we made it to the 10 minutes, so it don't matter. We probably can leave anyway. Toodles. Damn, I didn't even get y'all a message. I'll do it on the next one. I'll do it on the next one. <laughs>